Welcome to another tutorial. It's Danny, your Squarespace and Canva expert, and today I'm going to show you how to create a pop-up just like this one in your Squarespace website. So pop-ups are perfect to guide your visitors to take a certain action whether that is to tell them about a new sale or a new offer that you have going on or to guide them to a certain page or even to collect email addresses with a freebie. And so let's get started. So the first thing that you want to do is go to marketing and then you're going to click on promotional pop-up. And so as you can see, this is the pop-up that I have created before, but I'm going to show you how to create something similar to this. So first we're going to enable this display pop-up button, just like that. And then we're going to want to click on change layout. Just click save. And so here, just scroll down and go over all the styles that you have available. If you want your pop-up to cover the whole website, then maybe one of these at the bottom will work for you. If you want your pop-up just to be at the bottom um, or to the side, it's up to you. So just make sure to select the style that will go with your website. And I truly recommend that you select a style that has an image because it will convert so much better. And so once you find the style that you want, you're simply going to click select. And then let's go back. And now let's move on with the next step. So the next step is the action. So we're going to click here. And so here, think about your main goal. Is it to sign up for a newsletter or to click a certain button that will then take them to another page? And so if you want them to sign to your newsletter, you're going to click right here. And then you're just going to fill in the boxes. And so once you've added, you know, some placeholder text to the email field and the submit field, then what you're going to do is you're going to go to storage. And so here is where you can connect it to your Squarespace email campaigns. If you use that as your email provider, or you can even connect MailChimp or Google Drive just so that it creates a spreadsheet with all the emails of the people who sign up to your newsletter. So now let's say that you're offering a freebie in exchange of their email addresses. So then you're gonna click on post submit. And here, what I would do in the post submit message, I would actually add a link to your freebie, whether that is a video, a PDF guide, whatever it is, make sure to add it to the post submit message Unless, of course, you have already implemented an email campaign that will send out an email to them. So if that's the case, then don't worry about this. And then you would just click save. So now let's say that you just want to redirect them to another page, just like I did. So you're going to click on click a button. And so here you would add in the text for the button. So maybe something like download or let's change this to watch instantly. And then here's where you would add the link. And I always recommend that you open it up in a new window and then you would click save and you can always add two buttons, but that will give some people decision paralysis. So I recommend that you stick to just one button and then you're going to click save. Perfect. Now let's go to the next step, which is the content. So this is where you will add, you know, the headline and the body of your pop up. So this text right here. And so always make sure to write a headline, you know, that stands out, that has something of value because that's going to be the first thing that they're going to read. And so then here you would just add the body text. And now let's go to display and timing. So this is where you can edit when the pop-up shows up and, you know, in what pages of your website and after how many seconds. And so the first option is to show the pop-up on any first page or only on certain pages. And so then you would select all the pages that you want the pop up uh, to show at. But for this one, we're going to click on any first page. And so then we go to the timing. So I recommend here that you select both of these show on timer and a scroll. So then after five seconds, or you can even show the pop up immediately, but I recommend that you wait at least five seconds, if not 10 or 30. And then here you can select the percentage of when they scroll down. And so I recommend going for 25%. And so here now we have the frequency 
And so I've selected to make it very frequent. So let's say that someone visits my site today, the pop-up is going to be shown to them. And let's say that they return tomorrow, then the pop-up is going to show again to them. But you can always go for a week, two weeks, 30 days, but this is a very long time. So I would recommend either the next day or in a week. And then of course here, make sure that you have it checked for don't show up again after they have signed up and this one so that it shows on your phone. And so then you're just going to click save and then let's go back. And here is where you can customize your pop up. So here, just make sure to add an image in the right dimensions and you can add even several images so that it's like a slideshow and it's going to add movement and it's going to look really cool. So you would just click add images and select your photos. And now let's go back to the last step, which is to style our settings. So click on style. And here, just like in your Squarespace website, you have the ability to change the fonts, the color of the background, the color of the button. And so make sure that it's aligned with your brand and it's cohesive with your whole website. And so to change something, I would just click on it and then it's going to open up those settings. And here you can change the font, the color. You can even change it for mobile as well because it's going to be a little different. So make sure that the mobile has the same settings as this one. And so just make sure to go over all the settings and see what you can change. And finally, you will just click save and that's it. So now you have a beautiful pop-up in your Squarespace website that will definitely add to your conversion rate.